Hey ladies, so I wanted to do a quick tip video on how I wash my hair or easier way to wash my hair while I have an install or a sewing in my head. Personally, I don't like wetting my braids. I wouldn't want to wash my whole head and get everything wet just to, you know, wash my hair. My main goal would just be to wash my weave and my extensions and not really have to manipulate my natural hair and worry about you know the drying time and making sure it's dry all the way of my braids i just kind of leave that out of the equation i learned a technique that has definitely worked for me and made the process a lot easier and i'm just going to show you guys how it's done so all you're going to need is a brush and some rubber band so i'm going to go ahead and section my hair off into two sections it's really the only reason why i need the brush but just kind of brushing my hair so I can get clean sections before I start washing is section out my leave out. That's the only part of my natural hair that's going to be washed and my edges that are along the side. Um, usually I would just braid this up, but for the sake of the time of the video, I'm just going to clip it. And I split my hair straight down the middle. I'm gonna grab one section or one side and I'm going to split that into sections. really fast and simple on this side that is prepared to wash I'm gonna go ahead and do the other side really quick process in the shower personally I do it in the shower just to kind of um what's the saying kill two birds with one stone yeah um so <laughs> I will wash my hair first and then go ahead and take a shower I would just grab a ponytail and put this part under the water so if you're using the shower head I would just try my best you know just to get this section of my hair wet without touching my scalp and um, just go ahead and do that on both sides. And then I would go ahead and grab uh, my shampoo or conditioner. Also, for this section of hair, I run it under the sink faucet. Just so it's a small, a smaller tunnel of water and you won't wet too much. Um, so I would just try my hardest just to get this section of um, hair wet. And go ahead and shampoo that within itself. Also, after I were to dip this hair in water underneath the shower head i would grab my shampoo conditioner kind of open it up a little bit and then run my hands through the hair i rub it together just to make sure that it's lathered another method that i've seen someone use on youtube to easier to make the process a little easier they will fill a cup up with water and then they will take a section of hair and go ahead and dip it in the water like so and then once the hair is wet they do the same process of opening it up and just uh, lathering the hair with shampoo and conditioner and then you just rinse is is regular i would just another quick tip um i do this section first i wash it first and then i condition it and then i braid it and so this part's kind of deep conditioning while you do everything else. And this, your natural hair, you know, gets more moisture and is more, you know, replenished. Yeah, replenished. 
um, during the process while you're in the shower. So I just wanted to do a quick tip, quick video for you guys on how to make your hair life a little bit easier. And I wanted to do more videos like this. So you guys just leave comments down below if you like these, thumbs it up. And also comment down below more little quick tips you guys would want me to show you guys for my ladies at home who just need a little help. Um, so yeah, comment down below and tell me if you like it and what else you guys wanna see. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.